Well, we'll just do it then. Then. All right, let's go. Well, I'll go in first. I'm the only one who can fight if if anything happens. I guess. Oh yeah, please. Yeah, even though she's maybe ultimate assassin, but she always gets like a fighting instinct. Let a monkey. We walk through the hidden door, slowly closing into the hidden room. And there it is. And this must be the mastermind's room. Mm. Uh, what is up with this? And there's no doubt it's a decor. It's almost exactly the same day from Junko Sanoshima's. This is a hidden room. It's much bigger than I expected. Wait, this room's atmosphere. Seems like. Does it remind you of a remnant of despair that Maya Junko Inoshima? Kind of. The mastermind behind this killing game must be hiding in here. Why you? Yeah, where? Where is the mastermind hiding? You mean in the curtain? <laughs> it must be inside, is it? It must be the one big giant monokuma head, was it? Here. Huh? Huh? What is it? Was that monokuma's voice just now? Yahoo! Welcome to the final stage! Get it time for the final boss to make their debut! What? Where? Where is that voice coming from? It's gotta be on the curtain. For sure. Hmm. There's something draped in fabric. It looks suspicious. I mean, it's gonna be the one giant monokuma head, so where, uh, where Juku and the uh, like, hope, shiny in the way she's looking at it. I cautiously lift up the fabric and. There! There it is! A Monokuma head? What big one? <laughs> you found me! Or rather, you just found a place that you were meant to find! At any rate, you can't end the killing game! The killing game was born from the womb of despair. Starting with the killing game on Whole Speak Academy created by the ultimate despair. <laughs> they are connected! The killing game is despair itself. What is this? I'm not sure what the heck is this. Hey. Are you Monokuma? Hey, um. Of course! I'm not just any Monokuma. I am the overseer of the killing game, and the source of all Banakunamas. <laughs> so I've been given a special name, Mother Kuma! Really? Mother Kuma? Okay, that's a bit weird. Are you the one who produced all Manakumas? I wonder how I ever try and destroy it. Mother Kuma? Then... So then, the machine that makes spare Manakumas in this academy... Yeah? Oh, that's me! Here! You see this amazing machine behind me? It creates spare monokumas! All I gotta do is copy over my thought and... Yahoo! Presto! I give birth to myself! Give birth? Ah, oh, don't say something like that, that'll be weird. What is that? Huh? A spare monokuma? Can it be made that easily? I thought they were advanced robots. No way! Uh, yeah! That's all why I'm so easy. No. No, that might be a lie. They're trying to attract us with fake information. That's true. Anyone can see this thing is giving too much information far too conveniently. No way! Huh? But it's not lie! I can make a spare really easily. That's true. Could you do that right now? Right. Yeah! Try and make a new mark new monokuma! Huh? What's wrong? What? I can't birth the Malakuma for someone who doesn't love me! Really? Really just now? What about after it's born, huh? Did you think about that? Take some responsibility! Get out! Whatever, just give birth to the Malakuma! Birth refused! No, I won't do it! I'm not gonna give birth one for someone I don't like just cause they tell me to! This is stupid. Hurry up and give birth to Malakuma! Are you listening? 
We seek to give birth to a new Monokuma. Kizena's like, I'm not sure what the baby deal is. Hey now. It totally ignoring us. I wonder if the thing about the spares was a lie after all. A lie, huh? Why lie about that? There has to be said be there has to be some motivation to lie. And I got Mother Kuma set up bullet there. Hey. Hey, enough with this Monokuma. Let's hurry and search this room. You're right. You're right. The master is hiding in here somewhere. Hey, Suichi. Suichi, don't just stand around. Look for the mastermind. Uh, okay. Y yeah. That's right. First, we have to see if the mastermind is hiding here. There should be other clues here as well. Well, I found one thing. There's this weird one with blood stain all over it. A monopad? A monopad? There's blood on it. The handprint on it. Is it Rentaro's? Why? Whose monopad is this? Why is there a blood stain on it? That's. I don't know. But we should inspect it closely. If this is student handbook, the name of the owner should show up when it turns on. I start out with a monopad and. Huh? Ah, uh, survivor perk. Yep, no doubt. That's belong to Mentaros. This monopad is a survivor perk? That means, in addition to the video, Mentaros' survivor perk with this other monopad. No. Is this. A map of the Ultimate Academy? Oh god, that's a lot of things here as well. There's a there's a lot of maps there's like before it was there. Huh. And they also have some hidden room there as well. I know we couldn't barely see much exactly, but that's a lot. This place that open with the mysterious objects are labeled too. That's really something. They got like a whole map area. As well as a hidden room. Which means, this is a complete map of the ultimate academy for gifted juveniles. Hmm. So, Rentaro was given this map as part of the survivor perk. That's why he knew about the hidden door. Hmm? What's this? A message? Clues? Huh? Clue to end the killing game? That was strange. Why send a message from that? Oh god, that's a lot. I guess if we do it here. The mastermind who is behind the killing game is hiding somewhere within the academy. Your best chance of exposing them is what Malakuma needs to spare. At the time, the mastermind will go into the library's hidden room. To prove this hint is accurate, I will predict something. The first thing you will remember is the ultimate hunt. Yeah, it did something at one point, same thing when he said like uh, when everyone, when we, he asked everyone, saying, "Does anyone remember the ultimate hunt?" That'd be something. Only share this information with people who you know you can trust. How you determine with that will mean your life or your death. Return on mommy. So that message was runtime before you lost the memories. And we started a new killing game. A hint to yourself from yourself. That was part of Survivor perk. That's why Rintama brought it up, because he read this hint. You mentioned about Ultimate Hunt? Hey, I have a question. This might sound a little weird, but does the term Ultimate Hunt ring a bell for anyone? It's exactly what Monokuma wanted us to do. So what else is part of the plan? Is my memory part of it too? If it is, then... Can I even trust myself? Oh, and that's what you mean by that. He's saying, can I even trust myself means... He doesn't even not sure he could trust the message... What it says on the survivor perk. Even he didn't completely believe it. And he had no other choice. That's why he went to the la library. Hmm. That's what started all of this. Sometimes this particular thing a long time we have to go through this. I'm gonna take a long investigation, so I'm not sure how long it lasts exactly, so we try to keep going. That model pan isn't in the student handbook. It looks like something else. Well. But is that a blessing? 
Whose blood is this? If it were, if it went down, it had to be his. Like he must be holding on his on the path there. That's. I was going to check that. If I could determine whose blood is this, well, be that much closer to the truth. Hmm. How are you going to check? That's. The camera Kayani and I set up here. We could deduce it from the pictures, which I'm not sure I still dare lift it. I see. The picture is in Kokichi's room. That's right. That punk got evidence from the past case, just so he could. That's probably why he bringing all the evidence there, or why bring all the stuff there from the previous case. I bet he collected the picture too. By the way. So, which one do you need? There were several pictures, right? That's the last picture taken of Ritaro, the one in which he was trying to remove the camera. I see. The one where the camera lure him with the flash. Okay. Got it. I'll go retrieve it. So I'll let you handle this area. But Maki, be careful, okay? Keep on the exercise. I'm fighting. Hey. Hey. Who do you think I am? She's what's been sensing. She, she's not afraid of anything. You, you say, do you want to die? Even smile like that, make it as a joke. But, oh, I finally reached the point where I can tell that that was a joke. Yeah. And there's also a trash can there. But no time for that. The tandem is almost gonna like getting faster and faster. This is a trash can. That's true. A space gift is too. I posted there's some clue here. Might be, might be disposed of it, the evidence then? I'll open the trash can casually and... Huh? Ah! Uh, another surprise gasp. What is it? What's inside? Huh? What is this? This thing in the trash can is much heavier than I thought. What is it? Why? A shopper ball? Why is this here? Isn't that the one that Kaede used to murder Rintaro? But it looks clean, doesn't it? I'm not sure why... Did someone bring the spare, uh, shot put ball then? But who did bring it then? But there's nothing around it. But there's no blood in the shot. Can't be the one that Kaede used to kill Rintaro. Hmm. In that case, where did this come from? Why is this here? Oh. Uh, this is... I know something sticking to this shot put ball. What is it? Uh, um... A cloth fiber from something. Oh, that's the one the Kaede use. But the shampoo ball that was found in the crime scene had blood on it. It is not Kaede's doing. What does that even mean? It. I thought for sure it's excess. It. It just hit right on top of the head, doesn't it? But I mean. The the fact is that the, the fabrics here, that was came from like, it was hiding from the backpack, right? To conceal it, and she put it on the vent there, and trying to slip off of it and trying to hit on it. I'm not sure the timing, it might be the occasion, but depending on how Rito is trying to get closer and closer at the moment, but that was supposed to be hidden. But, I'm not sure why it's here. He spent it closely. I can see several pink fibers stuck to the surface of the shot. They're pink. Wait, that means this shot. I understand. I know how to pin down the mess around this killing game. Shop a ball with pink fiber. That means this whole thing was all set up. The Kaede is like. If Kaede did not kill Rintaro at that point, where is it made a mistake, or did someone bring in the, the spare shopper ball and smack into it before it happens? But I don't know, there's a lot, I don't know if this might be the case. Um, anything else? I'm not sure there's anything we can find, is there? A half broken door? We're finally able to get in thanks to Kibo destroying the hidden door. The only other way in was the car key. Of course, none of us had that, so we couldn't get in before. But it doesn't look like there's a car video on the inside of the hidden room, hidden door. 
I mean, frankly, you can still get out of it, can you? I looked through the rubble thoroughly, but didn't find anything like that. Which means, you don't need a car key to leave this room. In that case, placing dust on the car reader wouldn't have mattered if they came out from this side. Well, that'll be something. Um, what else can we look into exactly? Look at Malakuma. What? Part one! I got the ones that are yours before you make me birth another one. I wonder what it says about Sparrow was really true. Well, no one. You guess I talk to them then? Uh, and there's probably no doubt that the mask might keep here. There should be definitely be clues. Let's check thoroughly. Uh huh. Sure. Uh, where? Where is the mask my hiding? Please, Mother Kuma, let me ask you where the mask my is hiding. Wait, why? Why are you being so proper? Nope. House. Um. Open. I can't show you for that point. You will make the killing game less exciting. No doubt this is a mastermind's room. It's definitely for the venom to despair. Yeah? Oh! Isn't that obvious? Why? When you're right, you're right. The one you're looking for comes to this room quite often. Quite often? So then barely come here all the time. <laughs> but I'm not stupid enough to let you guys catch him in the act. What did you say? What did you say? It can't the, be. the mastermind isn't here? If they come frequently, then... <laughs> I think my hand just finally dawned on Suichi. Hint? Why? Why are you giving us hints? Do you want us to find the truth? Yeah. What if I do? As long as it makes the killing game more entertaining, and it goes. Well, that's... If it if there ends the killing game... Huh? Hmm? End the killing game? Oh, you... Haven't I been saying it over and over again this whole time? Yahoo! The killing game is eternal! It doesn't matter what you do, this killing game will absolutely and positively never end! The killing game is simple of despair! How can something so fun just end? Huh? What do you mean? Huh? Oh, you don't need to fret over what it means. All meaning aside, it's the truth. <laughs> Boo -hoo -hoo! The best thing you guys can do is just accept that truth. Clues to the mastermind has been added. So we got nothing then. Alright, I finished investigating everything I need to. So there's nothing we can do about that. Yeah? yeah? What's going on? I can't find the mastermind anywhere. Oh. They're worth hiding here. Did you find this, Richie? Uh, um... I spent everything I found, but I feel like there's so still something hidden here. Uh-oh. Again? Uh, uh... Again? Another... memory... Oh god. What's gonna remember next, exactly? I gotta fast forward again! To remember! Now what's gonna... Show us next. What? What's happened? What? This is. Oh, Malakuma? Hi! Hi, Yasuichi! Looks like you're finally woken up from a long sleep. Why are you here as well? I mean, that might be the moment in time before the killing game starts. What? Monokuma? Although we're meeting for the first time, you ain't know me. Well, of course you know. I'm famous after all. Host Pick Academy's Killing Game was the most watched in event in television history. Why is Monokuma here? It, it can't be. Hi, hello! Oh, but again, this is where it all begins. A brand new killing game, courtesy of the Gopher Project. Huh? K killing game? Well now. Now then, 
From here, things will proceed how they usually do. You all lose your memories and forget everything that's happened up to this point. The stakes of the Gopher Project, the hopes, the dreams of humanity, and trust to you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and you forget that you're the last 16 survivors of the human race, too. The bond of trust you afford, your disgusting promise of friendship. Oh, that's gonna go bye bye when the killing game starts. It's no use. What? Why are you doing this? Disappointing asking me questions. You're gonna forget everything anyway. Hey! Who behind this? Who are you? Chuko and is dead. And another... Like I said, there's no point. You'll just forget that too. Damn it. And I spit my mic here if I like. No reason to. You're lying. How could I ever forget this? Ta-da! That blackout light! There's something different to the flashback light. Huh? What? The blackout light has the power to induce total memory loss. The light emits simulates the basal nuclei and a hit the campus. Hey! Wait a minute! No, no, no! No! I'm not gonna wait! I'm gonna use this light, then I'm gonna shove you all into the lockers while you're unconscious. <laughs> and then, the killing game will begin. And that's how it is before the killing game. Uh, I remember my final lost memory. It, it can't be. That was from just after we woke up from cold sleep. Uh, okay. Yes, a memory from right before the killing game began. Mm -hmm. We were just we we were each woken up by Monokuma, and our memories were taken, and we were forced to do all this. This is. We're going to work together. And we promised to become friends. Wow. Manakuma, I'll never forgive you. That's terrible. Me too. I absolutely never forgive him. You're right. I feel the same way. But right now, we need to investigate. Dawn is coming. <laughs> the lead is here to me. You go check the other place. Huh? What? I want to leave you behind there, Himiko. You feel like there's still a mystery here, right, Sweetie? Now I'll find it for you. We're all trying to work together and find the truth. But I haven't found any clues yet. Okay. I need to recover my honor. But... Shimiko, will you be okay by yourself? I don't know. That's a stupid question. Right. Since I got that memory back, I'm now overwhelmed with anger. <laughs> with my skills, I'll catch the da Dash Deli Monokuma and the Mastermind. You're right. I understand. Then I'll leave it to you, Himiko. Wait, what? Wait, really? I say they're going to leave it to me? All by myself? You're the one who's saying that, Himiko! Don't take back your word or anything. What should we do? If you're not confident enough to do it, then you don't need to force yourself. No. No, I'm okay. Since you believe in me, I need to give it my all. Okay. I'll find a clue. You can even use, my, use up every last drop of my magic and kills me. Don't say such unlucky things. It'll be okay. I'll just let you know how determined I am. You guys should believe in me. And go on ahead. <laughs> Thank you. That really makes me feel ha better, Himiko. What should we do? What should we do? With how little time is left, it's probably best to split up, right? That's true. Yeah. We need to split up and check all the lines one more time. If we miss a clue in any of them, it will most likely be that one. Alright! Go ahead, let's go! Mm. Be careful. Okay. You too, Himiko. Well, what to do then? We ran out of time, I'm not sure how far we're gonna reach. When we left the hidden room... Oh no, I let the sound of it. We saw Keep on the Exodus in the fierce battle. Still... Oh god, Mount Thompson got break free for no reason. Game out! Game out! And then they blow out the whole hidden room entrance! Uh, uh. Oh, don't let me so see the buff. Now the whole thing got destroyed. Shuichi! Oh, you're right! I'll eat of you in truth! And they got hold up. Now he got stuck here. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm okay. 
What? The hidden door has been blocked by the rubble. No. Here we go! Oh god. The hidden door has been blocked by the rubble. We can't get in out. We can't get in out. Is Himiko trapped? Uh, okay. uh, I think so. Kibo. Kibo, can you do something? Hmm. I can destroy the debris, but without mo knowing Himiko's status, Unfortunately. it could be dangerous for me to just reckless attack. Stop it! Then, are you saying we should just leave her there? You can't! I can't do such a thing! We're friends! But. But I'm not strong enough to lift the debris. Well, that figures. Then. Let's use the exosols. Huh? What? What? Use the exosols? How? That's impossible. We don't have any more. Any more Muse inventions. In the Malakas are the exosols. That's wrong. Exactly. We're going to get Malakuma and the Malakops to do it. Incomprehensible. Malakuma and the Malakops? Remember. They don't want this either. Their objective is to continue the killing game. Please wait. Are you suggesting that we surrender to them and continue the killing game? Stop! But Himiko's in danger! Mexican her should be our first- No. No. We're going to end this killing game. Um... What do you mean? Do you have a plan of some sort? Okay. Yeah. Yes. I do. It just requires a little bit of detective work. We need to investigate some more. What? Huh? What about Himiko? That's... I'm worried about her. But we had to trust that she okay right now. We trust her when she said to leave everything to her. If we just stand around here, we're not respecting her wishes. <sighs> okay. Himiko is the ultimate magician. I bet she used her magic to find a clue in that room that just plain amazing. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure Himiko is okay. Um if you search in clues. I will investigate the classroom on the second floor. Why on the second floor? Huh? Huh? Well. I caught a glimpse of something odd there while battling the exosomes in the courtyard. Whatever clue you're looking for may be there. That's... Something odd. And you want me to check the classroom? I'm not sure if you want me to go investigate there. Hey! Just hurry! You don't have much time. It's nearly dawn. I'll commit that to my memory. And I'm worried about Himiko. Kibo. But you won't change the time limit, will you? Unfortunately. I can't keep any exosols attacks beyond that time limit. If we don't sell this soon, I'll be destroyed. If that happens, we'll lose a chance to destroy the ultimate academy. That would be the worst ending. No. It would be the ending of pure despair. Kibo. Hey! Tsumugi, I'm going to the second floor. Yeah! I don't know if I can get to all of them, but I'll do what I can. I'll see you later. Okay. And that's just with the confidence steps, Smoogie ran out of the uh, library. Timiko, just a little longer. Hope she's okay. And got maximum on friendship power. So that means we'll be able to get like take down the level four debris, right? Anyway, we have no time for this. It's almost dawn. I'm not sure we're gonna reach the time that we're gonna finish it on time before dawn happens. So we're gonna keep faster, faster. It's in someone on the second floor. So we have to go up here then. There's no telling how far we're gonna have to reach. And this must be it. Oh god. Even it takes some time to smack those things. Come on! Gee, this is really powerful, is it? Is it... This one? This room. If you get glass in the back. Okay, this one then. Like, he didn't say which classroom it is. Oh, there it is. Um... Keep on saying that he saw something on while finding the next courtyard. With his oddly stacked desk like that. Never seen London before. Should be able to see the entire courtyard from here. Okay. This must be what he was talking about. All right. Let's see if I can find something. Well, there's nothing here, but we can still smack the some desk there. It's something in the way. Oh, something glow. 
Honk on display. What, are, what is this desk? This keeper floating above it. That was not there before. That's a weird display coming out of it when I smacked the desk there. Is this connection to the computer? Hmm. This must be to something odd Kiba must was talking about. When I touched the keyboard, what is showing us? What, what, what the heck? What? Huh? Flashback setup? Flashback light setup? What? What is all this? Huh? Setup? Like, settings? Seeking answers, I press the enter key. Hello, Game Master. Oh, recall memories. Kind of like... Oh, I can move around here. Oh, wow. It shows recall memories. Ultimate talent, ultimate hunt, each motive, class funeral, the world's end and the gopher project. These are most of the memories from the previous chapters. Outside world in ruins. The tragedy. Unlocking new memory? What do you mean unlock a new memory? Or do these settings create new flashback lights? To test my deduction, I selected one of the categories. Should I just... Okay. <laughs> it feels like I'm clicking it. Like, um, I'm playing this on a keyboard. <laughs> it's not the way weird. I said, I'm pressing up and down. It's like trying to select it. So it says, select the subject you wish to remember. What do you mean so remember exactly? So there are still some memories we hadn't remembered yet? But if we can remember something new, there would definitely be a clue. Alright. Alright, let's try it. I wonder what kind of memory is it? Also the survivors. I'm not sure there's still a few of it. Like survivors, the outside world, killing gain, participants. That's all this. I guess you want me to play survivor then. Huh? Hmm? Select the subject you wish to remember? That sounds different. What does it mean by select? These are all memories we forgot. All of these should be true events. So why were we able to select one? In these categories, there are several inconsistencies about the survivors. Do I have to select the correct one? That's true. I suppose I'll choose Survivor on different planet. There's also another one as well. That's true. There's more hope for us. The survivor on different planet. Other survivors in the Ark. There are no survivors. Mm, that's strange. But okay. Adjusting to match other memories. What do you mean adjust? What the heck this says? Are you wish? Are you sure you wish to remember this memory? The symbol of hope holds peak academy. The worst incident in human history occurred. With the work of the Future Foundation, the world was rebuilt. But f falling meteorites causing an outbreak of an unknown virus. The Gopher Project was then executed. However, there were survivors on other planets. There were survivors on other ships similar to the Ark. Okay, I was like, uh, read through some and everything. But, okay. I suppose I'm meant to collect. Yes? Uh, um... Why not place it? Glass my light set up. Please take the flashback light from the reception area? Wait, you can make flashback lights? Where is it? Huh? That sound. If I remember correctly. It came from that locker. Away from the locker. What's inside? If I remember The sound I heard definitely came from the inside this locker. I'll open it. Uh flashback light? Uh, a flashback light? Why is it here? This is new. It's just got here. Uh, I just mean... as suspect. You can make flashback lights with that desk. Wait, are you seeing this whole memory? This flashback light is all just made up? You can make memories with it? That's a weird thing. Why can you even make that? 
This is all. It says Game Master, so it's all Mastermind's creations then? I don't know why it was hidden in the normal looking classroom. But there must be a switch hidden somewhere. Flipping that switch will cause this desk to activate. I'm sure Kipo saw all this when the room was destroyed. I'm sure hope so. But what interests me is exactly how these flashback lights were made. There's only one truth. There should only be one true memory. But this clearly allows you to choose. Why? And there's no indication of which are real. Is there more than one truth? What is the truth? And what are the lies? I don't know. I have a bad feeling about this. It might be something like it create memories or something. What happened to all those flashback life from all the previous chapters? Was all made up then? Right at the moment, the classroom door suddenly burst open. What? Then like wood, she got a BAM! Oh. There you are, Suichi! Ah, Himiko! I thought you was judge half on the side of the room! Himiko! H Himiko? Huh? The classroom changed back to normal. They turned off for some reason? So when the door opens, the classroom reverts back to normal? I can assume that was done in order to unfunctionate the room's purpose. So that's the way to keep it hidden then? The person operating all of this did not want us to see it. And if they're, if they're that cautious of us... Clues to the mastermind updated. So is the mastermind use that kind of thing to create memories then? Hey, sweetie. I don't know what you think, sweetie, but... Hey! Being able to survive, I was able to make this spectacular escape from the sealed room! Yeah, but how do you exactly escape? It's all shut! Oh. Uh, right! How did Himiko escape when the entrance was blocked by rubble? Yeah, I don't know. Uh, how'd you do it? Um... Himiko, how'd you get out of the end room? Because the hidden door in the library was destroyed. Uh, we were so worried about you. You were trapped in there. Yeah? Yeah? You see how I escaped from there? No, I don't know how did you do it. Uh, okay. No? <laughs> I see. You don't get it. You don't know how I escape it. I don't like to know how. I shall tell you! I escaped from the sea of with my magic! Um... Here we go. Now it's not the time for... Yeah, no time for this, so we're still on destruction already! Uh. Eek! Here we go. Are you okay? That was a close one. I almost died. Remember. I told you. Now it's not the time. Then... Got it. I'll tell you. I definitely used my magic, but... Then another thing to help me escape the sea of What's the girl's bathroom on the first floor of the school building? The girl's bathroom? So, why is it there? Huh? The bathroom? Hey, sweet. Do you want to go in there with me? Not intentionally with a weird number this, but... Yeah. Huh? huh? Stop it. I don't want you to go to the bathroom with me. Don't start getting weird thoughts. No, we're not We're not doing this sexual thing right now, Himiko. Not on time. We're in the middle of a crisis here, and we're almost done already. No. Uh, no. I know that. The girl's bathroom on the first floor? What does it have to do with the hidden room? That there doesn't appear to be any new clues other than the flashback light. You're right. Alright. I'll head to the bathroom. Yeah, we just gotta do it now. We better check what what did she Himiko did when she went using the girl's bathroom then? But we are not time for this. I wish you gave me some kind of like a map. For this one. Ah, uh, goes over here already. Um, What's going on in this bathroom? Does it something to do with the hidden room? Hmm. Once you come in, you understand. Seeing is believing. Follow me. Sure. Himiko gestured me closer. 
I walk into the girl's bathroom. The girl's bathroom, huh? Yeah. Just do it, then. Just be a man already. This is an emergency. Nothing you can do about that. Uh, now's not the time to think be thinking about boys and girls' bathroom. All right, I'll do it. I repeat several excuses in my mind as I step into the girls' bathroom. I mean, nothing that bad. Where is it? Um, what are we doing here, Himiko? Hmm. So just like the killing game in the whole speak academy. Huh? What do you mean? Okay. It's just like then, right? The hidden room and the bathroom are connected. Oh, there are hidden. They are connected from the bathroom to the hidden room. So in other words, Mastermind can go inside the girls' bathroom. So that'd be someone. The Mastermind is a female. You're not together with Jim Girl, that's one thing. Huh? The hidden room and the bathroom? Hey, Suichi. Not with the quick in this place. Jeez, caught up on the past killing games. How typical of Renna to despair. Is it this one? You feel the closet? Yeah. Uh, um... It looks like a normal closet, but. I carefully place my paw on the far wall of the closet. Ah! A, a hidden passage? That must be the way to have Mastermind get in there. So, it's not just one from the basement. There is one, which means there's two hidden passages in total. Is it surprising? Hidden pathway deep within the bathroom. Now, proceed through this pathway. I mean, why are you saying something like that? Okay. Yeah, let's go. I step through the false wall and into the hidden passageway. I appreciate you're gonna give me a long walk to get to where it leads to. Secret passage. Oh, jeez, I'm gonna to lead to, like, to the other side. And there's a door, but that leads to the mastermind's room, right? Yep, it does. Oh god, there's Malakuma got wrecked. It leads to the hidden room. The girls' bathroom and the hidden room in the library are connected. Yeah, and Malakuma got destroyed. Yeah. The library isn't the only way to get in and out in, of the hidden room. The hidden room had this secret passageway leading out of it. Wow, and on from the left side? No wonder. In the passageway connected the girls' bathroom on the first floor. But this passageway wasn't a Metal Survivor Perk map. Yeah, it'd be a shame that doesn't have one with it. I mean, if it's the Mastermind who know about the secret passage that had two pin path, then they would know for sure. This passageway was hidden, even from him. A hidden passageway. That only the mastermind knows about. Hmm. Passage connected to the girl's bathroom. A hidden room passageway. And I know uh, Malakuma is got wrecked and it's almost done. I'm not sure we're gonna make it in time. Malakuma's lying on the ground, likely due to the explosion. Uh, um... Is it broken? Hi, hello. I'm busted! Ah, uh, it's over. I can't go on. I can't birth any more Malakumas anymore. I want to birth more and more and more! Birth Malakumas, huh? Hey! Hey! Is it true that you can make a spare Malakumas? Yeah? Of course it's true! <laughs> Fine! Since it's the end for me, I guess I'll say it. I have built a voice print authentication system. Voice print authentication system? Why then? I can't bird Monokuma unless it doesn't in a person specifically say the word bird. Everybody does say bird. But what if I feel like something bad is gonna happen? Designate a person? So only one person who can say bird specifically, that means had to get bird to it. Here! To ensure that my mind can on birth into a welcoming environment, you know? Hey! Wait a minute, this designated person. Do you mean the mastermind? Only the mastermind's voice print, voice command will make you create a spare mind Akuma. 
Na head was on the house, so to speak. <laughs> oh, glory to the killer game! Oh god! Hey! Hey! Let's just buff up all wet fluid there. Hmm. He seems like it's really broken this time. That was a point clue. Monokuma creates spare Monokumas after receiving the Mastermind's voice command. Well, that's just something. You're right. Once more, I shall reveal the secret behind my escape from the seal room. Okay. Yes, please do. Hmm. But after you guys left this room, there was a huge explosion and I got flipped over. When I came to my sand, it looks like this. Uh, um. I suppose it went hurt. You're right. So I've been using my magic a lot lately. Mm -hmm. A magical backlash must have happened, and the way out got buried in rubble. Even I, that wise and powerful Himiko, panicked a little bit when I saw I was trapped in here. Hey. What happened after that? I... I banged on the walls and the floor and yelled for help. Calmly and rationally, of course. I'm sure. Hmm. Now I have to find a hidden pathway. And that's how I got out! Okay. And I ran into Kibo and he told me you were in one of the classrooms on the second floor. So I rushed over there. I see. So that's what happened. I understand now. Hey. Well, was I useful? Huh? Huh? See, Himiko is so concerned about that. I should probably get out of here. If the entrance to the bathroom were blocked by rubble, who could be completely trapped? Um, Himiko, let's go. I have a good idea of what's going on here. Hey. Hmm. Is that wrong? Hey. Just tell me straight, like a man. Huh? Tell you what? Hmm. Hidden pathway I found. Is it a useful clue? I would say it was. I mean, it went for you. You wouldn't really survive. I want to be useful for my friends. I can't have much investigation, can I? I couldn't find the mastermind. Ah, <laughs> uh, you worry about that? Okay. Himiko, not only were you useful, you may have cracked the case wide open. I see. Really? If I found such a major clue, that but I'm no ordinary person! Well, at least you got something. Hee <laughs> I'm terrified of my own magical power! Right, let's get out of here. Yeah. Like, we should get out of here before a bad thing's gonna happen. And it's almost done, and I don't wanna show it's gonna be a last long. It might be far too late already. Uh. Come on! Oh, jeez. Yeah, if we come this far, we're safe. Now that I feel safe, I'm not over it. Then... Uh, okay, I'll step outside. Blushing, I left the girls bound in as fast as I could. Okay, now what? What do we do? Ah, Maki! That was came out of nowhere. At the moment... Uh, no, wait, Maki! This is not what we can think! We're not doing weird stuff in the girl... He's switching out of the reason something weird in the girl's bathroom! Huh? Oh god, he's blushing! No! Isn't that what I respected? Ah! Uh. Uh -huh. <sighs> what were you doing? Why were you in the girl's bathroom? Oh, I like the monkey's expression on the face, but this is not what we're doing! Monkey! Monkey? It's not what it looks like! I'm just. Do you want to die? No, she's not saying jokingly! Uh. No, listen, there's a reason! Oh no, he means like a puppet in there. Oh, jeez! What? Don't do that when I'm doing my business! Uh, don't say that, we're shot when we're here. I can't believe myself you're doing that! What? Himiko inside? And you were in there? Switchy? No! Stop it! Stop speaking and believing it was true! Uh, um... Uh, okay, this is all huge misunderstanding. 
Well, I guess you went into the girls' bathroom without a reason. Okay, okay. I'll believe you. Oh god. I don't like the expression of like thinking. Why switch in the girls' bathroom? Thank you. Th thank you. Though it still seems like you want to murder me. By the way. Anyway, I found this. Ah, this must be the picture from when Mermintown was closer, right? And yeah, no doubt, he was holding it. Oh. Mertal's picture! Thank you. I took the photograph from her and inspected closely. Yeah, no doubt. He, that one he was holding, it was Survivor perk. That's why he knows about the hidden passage then. Just as I thought. I sighed to myself, looking over the picture. Everything was beginning to connect in my mind. I finally saw through all of the lies. Final picture of Rintaro. That means we able to like solve the mystery about the first case then? With this, I can fight. I can fight the mastermind behind this killing game. And I believe I can end it all. Hey. You look like you just realized something. Well. But what do you want to do now? It's almost done. It's bad. We don't even know the mastermind's identity or where they are. Leave it to me. It's okay. I have a plan. Can you two please go get Samuki? She should be in one of the labs. After all, after that, I'll let everyone to get in the courtyard. Okay. I'll be waiting for you there. What's that mean? What do you mean? What are you planning on doing? That's... Stop the killing game, of course. Mm -hmm. But we haven't even found the mastermind, so how... I'm right already. We can talk about that later. We don't have much time left. So let's hurry and find Sumugi. Hmm. Oh, I see. I still I want Himiko and Maki. To go off to find Smoogie. Well, we ain't no time for that. All right. All right, to the courtyard. But before I stop this killing game, I need to stop the destruction of the Ultimate Academy. Damn, I used too much time. It's done already. God dang it, already! I was so close. How is it not in that far end? Is it what? Is it game over now? I mean, I was so really close. You took too long. Be careful, you don't have time to investigate everything. I completed all the investigation and everything! What do you want from me? Only investigate what you need to. Except the fact there's a the amount of Kuma pluses in the way, so... Okay, you lead me back to, like, where... Lead me back to the bathroom now. Um, so I'm gonna jump card to where we left out here, so... Mm. I'll be back for a bit. Okay, now we got something. It's funny that we just expand the time for a bit, like, for far back, even though the investigation almost done already. Ugh, it's such a pain in all this. Maybe because I'm wasting time because I saw the Malakuma's there plush over there. I can't quit Chavo, so I can't do that at one point. So it'd be suck, but that's how to deal with So I'm gonna do it like a normal way then. When I step out in the courtyard, I yell at the top of my voice. It's almost done already. Kibo! Kibo! Makuma! Please stop fighting! We can solve this another way! One that's best for both of us! Both of you! Please! Listen to me! My force reverberated throughout the courtyard. And after a while. Now what? It's almost dawn, like we agreed. Have you found what you were looking for? Are you ready to do what must be done, Shuichi? Either way, this is your last chance. What's Shuichi gonna do? I have no idea what's going on, but messing with this robot is starting to bore me, so I guess I'll hear you out. At least Monokuma, like, 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 pause there. And what's Shuichi gonna say? So, what is this other way? A class trial. A class trial? We're all gonna do a class trial one last time. Oh, so we're gonna do it like same thing like before, like how we're trying to reveal the mastermind. A class trial? That's. What do you mean? Are you trying to continue the killing game? You. This is no time to mess around. I thought you were going to end it. No. I'm not messing around. That's wrong. This class trial will end the killing game. 
Huh? A class child to end the killing game? As Kipo spoke, I saw Maki running over from the school building. Oh, and it was all here. What are you talking about? Hey, what do you mean we're going to do a class trial? You. Are you serious? It can't be. That's... How are you going to end the class killing game? Okay. Everyone's here. Now let me say this. We need to start fighting. And have one more class trial. That's it. If we reveal the whole truth here, there, we can end this killing game. What are you saying? The killing game will end when the truth is exposed? Why would you say such a thing? That's... By the end of the class trial, that will be clear. Manakuma, you're the one who calls these class trials. All right. But not this time. This time, we choose to call the class trial. One to end them all. But, why do we need to hold a class trial when no one was been killed? Well, it's fine. That's what I like to say. But, I get it. Really? You really want to take words from Shuichi? What? What? Cause... My little shootout with this rundown robot and been fun for a while now. <laughs> and, I think it's pretty interesting that you guys are on the board with hiding a class trial. Or holding a class trial. In fact, I welcome your initiatives. This turn of events will make this very interesting. So, even in this circumstance, you take the opportunity to make things interesting. That means this killing game must be. However, if we're gonna hold a class trial, I'm gonna hold you guys responsible for it. Huh? Responsible? It would be bad if we held a class trial that we that didn't reach the satisfying conclusion. In other words, in other words, if the trial doesn't go your way and without the truth being exposed, to tell you the truth. then you all will be held responsible for stinking such a disappointing class trial. Uh, okay. Uh, of course. <laughs> I don't doubt your resolve at all. But uh, the others okay with it too. The responsibility will be shared by all of you. What was that? The, the responsibility will be shared. But we've been ready. That's true. I trust you. But if you screw this up, <laughs> I'll keep it for Monokuma can. Okay. Y yeah, I believe you. You're right. You're right. There's no point freaking out now. Hmm. I have friends I can trust. There's nothing to be scared of. Um, Kipo? Yeah. Also, if we're gonna do this class trial, you gotta take off all that fancy sci fi gear. We can't risk you going berserk if the outcome isn't in your favor. See. Take off this gear. If I remove this armament now, I will lose my chance to destroy this academy. This is the last chance. The last chance to not let Monokuma win. This is. Really all right? Um, Kibo, please believe me. I don't want Manakuma to win. We're going to win. Our hope is going to end this game of despair. But do you really think that ending awaits us? It's not too good to be true, honestly. Okay. Yes, I do. That ending is hope for us, and we can't give up hope on hope. Keep on. Let's trust Sweetie here. Mm -hmm. You don't want to die either, right? Right. We're all friends. We can believe in each other, aren't we? I understand. Very well. I removed my armaments. Let's hold this class trial. Thank you. Thank you, Kibo. <laughs> then it decided. All right. That's right. Our class trial. That's it. A final battle. Our hope and. We'll defeat your despair. Why? Why are you laughing? Gross. You see that goblin who win? It's fine. It'll be okay. He's probably just bluffing. Yeah, some one reference I know. 
who can say? Well, and we're gonna do this class channel. We should hurry up and head to the trial grounds. Oh. However, I had the Malaka strip that robot of this gear. Yeah. I know. You guys. Everyone else, please proceed to the Shrine of Judgment and head to the trial grounds. <laughs> I'll go on ahead and begin preparing. Malaka, you can take it from here. So All right then, we're gonna, we're gonna take all this gear off this rubber. Let's do this! I'll finish a second cause I don't work like I eat. Fast and sloppy! You shouldn't be proud of being sloppy. Everyone! I'll meet you guys there. Uh, okay. Yeah. Keeper walked back towards his lab with the exosomes. Nice way we did that together. Then... We should go too. Don't tell me. I can't believe we're having another class trial. I mean, this will be the final class trial after all. Why? I don't think Final Kuma would have said so easily. That was too easy. I can't help but feel a little strange. It's from that one thing. He probably agreed to it. Agreed to it to stop Kiba from destroying the Academy. Still, it was almost too easy. Perhaps Monokuma simply expected this. But it was still much easier than I imagined it would be. No sense worrying about that now. we come this far, we just have to do it. To end this killing game, we have to follow his rules one last time. And win this class trial. Well, we better just see how this goes. Well, man, that took like almost like two hours long. I might have to cut, like, cut from the two parts for a bit. So, I'm not sure how far we're gonna have to make this much, so. Yeah. Maybe I'll upload it for today, and next one for tomorrow. Nah, and it looks like old. Right. Looks like everything got destroyed as well. Thank you for that. For that. Next time we come out of the trial grounds, oh, oh, it'll be over, right? Mm. We can win, right? Okay. Uh, of course. It's okay. It'll be okay. This class trial should be much easier than the others. What? Huh? Why? Because... Up until now, we had to find the culprits among the people in our group during the class trials. That's why we couldn't work together even if we want to. But, this time, it's different. I see. Ah! Since there isn't a culprit among us, we can work together without any doubt. Ah. We're all going to be working together this time. I want to feel more at ease. But Switchy is feeling tension like this still might be mastermind might be among one of us. But I wish that happened sooner. The beginning there were 16 of us. But now that there's only 4 of us standing here, plus keep on who's coming later. Well... We're about to head to the last battle. Why are you so depressed? Sorry. Oh, sorry. You're right. And Kibo's back. Everyone. Thank you for waiting. And you got your hairpiece back. Kibo. That was fast, Kibo. His weapon has been removed. I suppose we don't have to worry about him attacking. What? what? Are you disappointed? Do you prefer your cypher again after all? No. No. It's not that. Everyone. I'm just... Very sorry. Kibo bowed the waste of to us. Why you apologize for trying to make destruction? <sighs> I act recklessly and put you all in serious danger. Everyone! I'm sorry. I'm very, very sorry. What? Huh? What's wrong? Totally different from before we when you were uh, in battle mode. Um Sweetie. You told me earlier not to give up hope. Uh, okay. Th that's right. I I finally realized that you were right. My inner voice told me. Oh, you got your vo inner voice back? Hmm. Your inner voice? I thought you said you couldn't hear anymore. Well, I had Malakos repair me in addition to removing my battle gear. Now, for some reason, I could hear my inner voice again. Really? How did it happen? That's better because of your hair piece you turned back. Is that the reason? So you could hear. So you can hear it again after the repairs. 
it looks like his hair looks like an antenna. <laughs> Why do you think it looks like an antenna? Does that mean it wasn't just decorations? And now that I think about it, what is his inner voice exactly? What does he hear? I mean, I'm not sure exactly who is this inner voice is exactly. Is this, like, someone special to him? I was wrong to trying to destroy everything, just to avoid losing to despair. Even if I had followed through, though, there would have been no hope or future left afterward. In which case, my action would have merely resulted in a different despair altogether. I do not expect you to forgive me. What I did was foolish. Please. But, will you allow me to fight alongside you? I want to help you find the truth. Please! I'm... Of course, Kipo. That's what I wanted from the start. <laughs> if it wasn't for you, we wouldn't have been able to do this. <laughs> so... You allow me? <laughs> oh, you seem angry, Smoogie. Would you prefer I'm not help? Well... I'm not mad. I'm just holding myself back. For what? When someone said please that strongly, I always want to respond with, but I refuse. But I can't read the mood here. So I'm holding back. Mm. Well, of course. It's fine. Yeah, I'm okay now. Of course you can fight with us, Kibo. There's a big wall between living things and objects. But you're our friends, Kipo. Everyone! D thank you. Um, by the way, Maki, I've been meaning to ask you, but... What is that? Vacuum cleaner you're clearing? Um, oh, I forgot Maki is still holding it. I see. It's about Vac. I think Okichi designed it and had Mio make it. I see. Ah, yes. Gonta has mentioned something about tiny bugs before. Okay. Yeah, I thought it could be some, a clue to something. But we can't seem to catch any bugs with it. it doesn't seem like there are any. <sighs> so really just Gonta's imagination after all. No. Wait, it might be too soon to determine that. Then, well, you may be open to robot. Can, can you see it? Can we wait until I examine it with my eyes, at least? Your eyes? What you gonna do? Um, what do you mean, Kibo? You. What can your eyes do? Now that you got a good eyesight, right? Yeah. That was true. I thought I installed my zoom function. Zoom function? That's weird coming from him. Huh? Your zoom function? Wasn't Muse made it? Yes. It was in my lab. Next to the jetpack and ro rocket launcher. Oh, really? There is something. Thanks to the zoom function, my vision has increased a hundredfold. Huh? A hundredfold? What did you say? That's a power up that goes way past your default settings. But this is the true talent of the ultimate robot. Because I'm a robot, I can evolve in ways that are simply not possible for a human. I finally accept that. There are notable differences between us, but there are nothing for me to be ashamed of. I also... Because, with my talent, it's possible that I can save you all. Kipo took the buck mac from Maki and... Leave it to me. It's worth a shot. At maximum zoom, my vision is on the par with that of a microscope. Maki, I'll borrow this buck mac for a moment. He stared at it intensely. What's gonna, like... You know, I think there's gonna be bug inside. Oh. I'll print out this memory. Oh, there are something in there. Oh, I see. There's zoom function. I thought it was his eye thing. No, it's one of those gear things from, for the eyes things. But what the heck? It's a tiny little monokumas with cameras holding. Just before, keep a print a picture from right out of his mouth. Ugh, again? He took it from his lips and handed it to me. Is this Monokuma? It looks like a like little bit of bug with tiny little camera with it. Hey. Are these the small bugs Gonta was talking about? Yes. A human's eye would not be able to see things that exist at the nanoscopic level. 
a gump that they had to notice him. This vision really was superhuman. Hey. Hey. What are these things holding? Are they holding cameras? I mean, that's what well, it is. Then. Why don't we ask them? Huh? We can talk to this? I mean, not. How can we give it to talk to him? Leave it to me. Yes. I've already installed an augmented hearing function. What was that? I get anything as possible. I can't even hear what he's saying. Start talking now, or I'll squish you one by one. Whatever function you serve, you'll be unable to carry it out. Oh boy. I'm not sorry I would do that. Do you accept these terms? Keep on asking the way that made it clear it was not my, not the negotiation. Sound like blackmail. They call themselves nano -themes. Apparently they're members of the monocups. Wait, does like lower level than the monocups? That's a weird. What? This little thing? Then there were actually six monocups? Not quite. These don't exist as individuals, but rather as a hive mind. Really? They travel through the air in a swarm, covering every square inch of this campus. So it's not just one, it's a whole swarm of mama cups. Really though? For this tiny little creatures? With the camera on? What was that for exactly? Bleh! I bet not! I don't like the thought of that! Me too! And their function is to record footage of the events that are unfolding here and transmit it to Monokuma. What? Really though? Is that the reason why I can't able to... No? Using their tiny cameras, they record footage and transmit it wirelessly. Mother Kuma receives the footage and parses it before sending it off to Monokuma. Oh! So that's how it goes. So the Nanakuma's got the footage where it's looking at and then send the signal to a mother kuma and give and then pass it over to the monokuma. So they get into the full details about the case then. Man, would I explain what happened on the chapter five? That why Monokuma can't remember it? Or don't even know who the blacken is? Damn, no expect that coming from it. You mean like a security camera? They're so small that they can't get be seen with the naked eye. They must be the security cameras. But I thought for sure security cameras was everywhere you could see. But this little creatures? That's something. So, there are security cameras after all? Mm -hmm. And they've been recording the footage wirelessly? Kokiji was correct to use the electro bomb. Ah, uh, because you're trying because everything's electricity, it disabled all the cameras, right? Punk. When you use it, the Nanakumas were unable to send any footage back to Monokuma. You're right. Yes. In that case, I doubt Monokuma knew the real culprit. Uh, um, the more I learn, the more I wish that Kokichi had just worked with us normally. But... That's impossible. No matter how many times he reincarnates, he's a liar down to his soul. I never would have imagined that the sixth monocup would be security cameras. That time Monokuma was able to keep watch to this entire academy. He's toying with us. He's not just confident. He's sure he's going to win. I know that must be what he's thinking. Oh yeah. At least we know we know that important detail now. I'm glad you told us before the class trial. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Kipo! By the way, you're welcome. But we should get going now. That's true. Yeah, we don't know what Malakuma will do if we show up late. That's fine. Yeah, right. Well, let's start to head into the trial grounds. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it took a long time for the conversation, does it? Well, anyway, let's get started already. You're saying they're not moving anything. Yeah, some of the statue were destroyed. Uh, there's no water physics as well. I mean, it's more likely this is the final battle after all. This is it. Alright. Let's go. There's no point in worrying anymore. Right now. We only need to think about getting out of here alive. 
So we put the destroyed Ultimate Academy behind us and head to the final trial grounds. It's strange that the white, there's no cage there before. I guess it might be a bug then? Eh, uh, whatever. Carrying the last of the survivors, the elevator brought us down. Still same as usual. What could be waiting for the five of us? I'm sure this is the end of despair. It's the beginning of hope. Everything ends here. Everything. The killing game, the host pick academy, the killing game of Jabberwock Island. I meant to Jabberwock Island. And the killing game of this ultimate academy. How much more until they're satisfied? This is the end of it. I'm tired of this. We're going to end it. We're going to end this cruel game. We got achievement, class trial of the century. So this is the final trial grounds. Yep. Make the final preparation. So this is most like is the final trials, huh? It's not up to you or me to decide whether or not this is the end. Huh? What do you mean? Well, well. More importantly, since you guys requested that we hold this class trial, I'm sure you won't mind allowing me to participate too. Right? I mean, not the same thing like last time, but... I mean, why bother? You are willing to participate for the... Like the same thing that happened in final chapters. I mean, that's how you do it. Right. It'll be easy to argue if I do. That's true. True. I was going to have you participate this time. But I didn't think you volunteer. What is it? You seem confident. <laughs> With my magic. You're confident now. But I'm gonna turn your body into omnibus. With my magic. Actually. An, an omnibus? Do you mean the vehicle or like a compilation book or? I'm pretty sure the omnibus might be the like old vehicle thing, whatever. Look it off! I won't be provoked by your cheap stats! Aww. Is he really provoked? Yeah, but- If Pops is gonna participate, things are gonna get pretty damn interesting! Father! You can do it, Father! Get a rock hard We're right cheering right? on to our voice of horn and bleeding! Run all them! That's wonderful. This is beautiful. Wow. Hmm? Stupid. Cheer me on! You guys are totally participating too. Oh, really? <laughs> what? Oh god, everyone's all shocked as well. Well, you get the boys dragging it into it. <laughs> you can't have a poignant role to play. What kind of dad would be? Would I be if I hung the spotlight? If your kid don't play a poignant role, then what use are any of you? Um, poignant role? Can we really do it? I don't know. <laughs> don't worry. As a good parent, I will do my darn best to motivate you. With what? Well, With this button. No oh, God. Is it the name button? Please tell me it's not be some kind of like such a shop button or to the mother calls. What? What? The button for? <laughs> it's a mother call detonator. Now I prepare to ensure my adorable kids do their very best. Why? Why would you do that? <laughs> D darn detonator. With the push of this button, I'll then add the bond inside each of your bodies. But you're not sure who or which one you're gonna blow up with. So make sure you try really hard. Or start pressing this button. Got it? Hey. That's too far. Here. You know what they said? If your kids are cute, put a bomb inside of them. That's not how it goes. Are you stupid. That's not a real saying. Cause I know you cute kids can do this. You just need a proper motivation. So no need to worry. Just make sure you all play proper the roles. That's all. <laughs> ah! Oh, How absurd. I knew it. You really are the worst. <laughs> I'm the best at being the worst. Don't you think so? <laughs> I'll tell ya. People can't get enough of my cruel antics. Alright. Let's get started! Let's get this cool climax underway! We're just getting right here. 
Oh yeah, and this right here. Nah. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, this is the longest one, aren't we? To hear the music and all that. And they have it. We're on to the class trial that fast, to say the least. So, yep. I know that this is. It took me like two hours and thirty minutes. That's a long recording I'm having. So I'm gonna have to make some separate parts, like I usually does back then. Like long time since um, Dark Number Two, I try and make separate parts of it. So this is gonna be really hard to. Not sure how far it's gonna take exactly. Even I want to make another video at one point of the next uh, to next day, but I guess best not to it. But anyway, we're on the final chapter. Next bit, we're all so close to finish this. I really. Really want this to end in already. I know the fact that this is the the final last game after all. I mean there's no point in making another Dongamaba game anymore. Except for Switch. The that makes it kinda of like a some kinda of like make all combination together and in do something like a something like a uh some other games that I'm not sure what it is exactly, but I don't care. But anyways, um so I'm not sure the next, the final class trial is gonna be longer, just like anybody else's. I mean, there will be like no save points or anything, no intermission or anything. I think it has any ever on chapter two, so I don't know. Best we just gonna do it longer as fast as we can. So but anyway, that pretty much a long of it. in harmony. This is video. Hit the like button too. Line them up. Eh, what's the video? Go subscribe. Until then, I'll see you guys next time. Later!